After 18 contestants and 26 days on some islands in Fiji, a winner of Survivor 44 was crowned last night. <laughs> and of course, with being named sole survivor, the person also wins a cool $1 million. I was thinking about this. I don't know if a $1 million is worth it to me to go through all this I stuff. I know. You've been to through. Fiji. Was your experience like that? No. <laughs> Maybe in a way. It was <laughs> if you not haven't like seen that. the finale yet, though, we don't want to spoil it for you. So you might want to turn away for the next three minutes or so because our very own Suzanne Marquez is here and she's going to have the winner in just a moment. Good morning. Yes, I'm here to ruin it for everybody yes. if you recorded it <laughs> last <Spoiler> night. Spoiler alert. <laughs> so alert, folks, but I'm sure most of you did stay up late. It was three hours, and it was pretty intense and, and an incredible finale, frankly. Some have called this overall season an absolute banger, but in the end, there was just one winner, and it was somebody who our 8 a.m. producer predicted, Jam Jam. 36-year-old Jamil Orocho, a salon owner from Puerto Rico, and Jam Jam is joining us live. Good morning. How are you? Hi. Good morning. How you doing? I'm great, but you're better than me, million dollars richer. How are you feeling this morning? My pocket is too tiny for that million dollars. I need a bigger <laughs> pant. <laughs> and you know what? This is why we love you, Jam Jam, because you are hilarious. You are so much fun. But let's talk about one of the most emotional moments of the season. It happened last night when you helped Carson prepare to learn how to do fire just as good as you. And then he, of course, went up for that final fire making challenge. And it's, it was a beautiful moment. Uh, what inspired you to want to help out your teammate? Jam Jam, can we hear you? Oh, can you hear us now? Oh, here we are. Yes, we I have can. you back. Okay. So what was it like helping out Carson last night? Helping Carson was not a game for me. It was me helping my friend. He's so successful at everything he did out there that to see him like breaking down because of something like I could have helped him with is the only reason I did it. It was like even if it meant me losing to him because I gave him the tools, it was was something more. And this is why I love the experience. My friendships with them mean the world to me. And for folks who maybe didn't watch last night, it did come down to that final fire making challenge. And you're the fastest one on the whole island. So you definitely would have won anyway. You definitely would have made it to the final three. So I think you were shoe in to win very early on. And let's talk about the infamous Tika tribe with Carson and Carolyn. And what, what, did, what did it mean to you to have a bond like that on the island? Because everybody's ultimately out for themselves. In a game where we have nothing, we have no money, no cars, no house, not clothes, like the only thing we have is our bonds. So my friendship with them was the most valuable thing. And I love people and I love these, guy, these guys and they are my family now. And to be able to have fun with them, it's why we bonded the way we bonded because we were playing, we love Survivor, we were strategizing against each other, but it was fun. And you if it wasn't fun, fun, it was and not right. What are you gonna spend that money on, Jam Jam? I have no idea, I have no idea, because it's been a secret for so long that I haven't been even like figured it out, you know? I'm definitely like printing a copy of it and putting it in my fridge so I can see it every morning, <laughs> but I'm probably just gonna, you know, I have no idea. Do you have any good ideas? You know what? My idea is to invest it. Like, you know, buy some property or something. Don't go spend a bunch of money. Like okay. lease a car. Uh, Do uh, not b spend all that money on a Ferrari or something. No, <laughs> if I've no, learned no, anything no. talking to winners, invest, invest, invest. But that's not as okay. fun as it, Jam Jam. Thank you. <laughs> I will try to do that. Claire is a good investor, so I, I'll figure out something with Claire. There from you my go. Season. Exactly. You guys are bonded for life. Thank you so much, Jam Jam, for joining us. Congrats again, Jamie and Ruta Bay. You can see why Jam Jam won. He's just a delight. Oh my God. Oh my God. You are a delight. <laughs> is, is the money really in the Love. fridge? I know. Are you really going to print a copy? Yeah, I mean, you get that Most once in a lifetime, definitely. right? Definitely. <laughs> I've never had that many zeros. Exactly. Oh, wow. Okay. On the right side, right? Because there's zeros on the other side. <laughs> <laughs> this is fantastic. I know. And you know what? I see you getting a Fiji sponsorship, too. By the way, that was a very nice drink. <laughs> I paid for this one. It was not sponsored. <laughs> it was probably 12 out. bucks in the hotel room. <laughs> All right, Suzanne. Exactly. Jam, Jam, thank you. See, he's already spending that money on frivolous things like Fiji. Water.